welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle Hi, how are you all doing? Um, uh, today I'm going to be doing a walk with me Sandown um, Seafront and um, look at all the activities that uh, you can do and uh, scenery and I'm going to be doing a walk with me. Hi, if you're new here to my channel, please subscribe and uh, don't forget to click the, the, click the notification bell so you never miss an upload. A big thank you and thumbs up to doing, for doing that. Uh, please share also, um, I'd be extremely grateful. Um, so this is the footage video. And first of all, I'm going to kick up, off with um, Brown's uh, Golf Resort and um, also Blue Tiki Cafe for coffee, food, ice cream. And that's the Golf and Cafe Club. Um, this is the Dinosaur Isle Car Park. Um, said in a previous video, video um, again for the price um, I really recommend especially if you're into paleontology checking out the dinosaur island well worth it and if you go there a lot then you'd be also be able to get um, a season ticket So, you can get up there to the seafront. On the seafront, there's obviously a, um, a lifeboat, uh, well, a life saving ring, red ring, and also some seats to sit. Um, again, it's um, Sandy Beach lovely clear skies today um, don't forget um, if you're interested in the dinosaur museum please ch check out um, my uh, last video and I'll, I'll give you a review of it the Dinosaur Museum is also next to a, a beautiful pond. Oh, upsie daisy. There's the pond. Moving along now, we've got like, it looks like a high ropes course. Also, no swimming or boating or fishing in the pond, danger deep water. There's a cool breeze as well, but it's still sunny, it's not again too cold today. And you can actually walk round, it looks like, the pond. Uh, please do not feed the docks white bread. But yes, it's a beautiful pond.
but yes, this looks like a high ropes course. And um, there's uh, some bins. Beautiful that I've never see, uh, seen before. Blue painted um, uh, wooden seats and just normal benches it's called sand hands sky nets and it look uh, you can also buy ice cream artificial grass So adults are £14, children 5 plus £14, children 3 and 4 £7, a company and an adult £7. So, Yes, it looks like um, a large uh, playground. Uh, playground. Etc. for older children and and possibly adults um, and there's also a children's playground and bowls area for children a, a park And uh, for young adults and teenagers, it looks like there's a sports at like Sandown Bolts and Sports Club over there. And a skate park and also seating area. Blue benches have all been painted up, well painted up. There's an absolute lots to do, um, indoors and outdoors, and um, in Sandown. This is the Adventure Golf, and it's Dinosaur 13 to go with the Dinosaur Museum. Lots of bins around as well. Whoa. Oh wow! That waterfall is abs absolutely stunning feature.
and it's called Dino Islands. There's um, a bus stop if you're coming by bus to this area and also lots of places to sit. And a bus, a bus timetable. And here's the sea. It's not clear blue, but and the tide's definitely in today. Sandown Community Partners about the fort. Um, gardens. It looks like you can get ice cream. There's also the bandstand where you can get ca a cafe and a menu. Sand and gardens, just um, everything seems really well themed. That's the coach park down there, and also a car park. Breakwaters, further information. It looks like apartments. Or maybe a hotel and apartments. Again, that uh, operate uh, more in the summer. Because we're in April and it's out of season, um, not all of um, the places are open. It's a good idea if you're looking to have something to eat on the beach. But also in 
Santander's ideal uh, place is to have a picnic. You can bring your own food. Now this is Sands Hotel. Beautifully decorated. You can hire beats, beach huts to uh, rent available from April the, the 1st. Also, that looks like it's a, a bar at night. There's like lots of bins and seats to sit, so if you do... These are probably houses, um, or, or, or well, not houses, but bon bungalows that you could probably rent. And here are the beach huts. Looks like another beach bar down there and surfing. That's why I'm all seats. Hotel Marina. The Sandown Hotel. So a plenty of accommodation to choose from as well in Sandown. Shipwrecked Marina Society. This is old Second World World War mine. It helps to support dependents uh, that was lost at sea, as well as sick and disabled and retired. Um, so again, it's charity. I'm going to put some money in there. Because it's well worth helping people out. Castles and Innovations postcard. This is the Sandown Trail again. Let's just do my bag up. There's some toilets on the beach. And here are the beach pots different styles. There's some older and new ones. Surfboarding, bodyboarding, paddleboarding, school groups, I surf. surf. Um, this is disabled um, men's and like, like unisex toilets, all beautifully brightened up, and some beautiful, bright um, 
artwork to go with it at the back. I apologise, this is a really long video. There's Short Stay Car Park. Um, let's have a look up here. That's another beach bar where you can sit and have ice cream or a drink. Yes, um, it's a really nice walk to um, whether you've got pets like dogs. And um, to walk along the the coastal path. That Sandown Library as well. Sure, Waves Cafe and Takeaway will be open in the summer. This is the sound. Linkham Hotel. Again, there's car parking here, pay at the machine. So lots of parking around. If you look up there, then there's um, and down, down here and it comes to light at night which is beautiful later on tonight I'll show you a, a video of Sandown all lit up um, on the, the pier Um, please let me know in the comments what you think of uh, Sandown or, and um, any other area that I've reviewed on holiday. I'm really interested in your thoughts. Bar restaurant. This is milky ice cream. And um, ice lollies. Takeaway cafe. More seating. First aid and lifeguard station that way. Here's some more bins, and this is another war manorion. These these um, again must be all the people that have died, unfortunately.
from the First and the uh, Second World War, it looks like. Dogs are prohibited this area and the beach. They're digging the beach up at the minute, around this part of the beach anyway. Emergency equipment. Looks like more people unfortunately have passed away. It's lovely how they give them plaques. To, uh, to remember them. More seating over here. The Ocean Hotel is not operational. It would be nice if they could uh, do the hotel off again. Recycling. This is a, another hotel, and again, if it does rain, then there's sheltered seating, which is always nice. Or if you wanted to even sit out in the sun, that's a Proval Hotel. This is NAB Tower Postcard Heritage Trail. Dogs are, are not permitted on the beach in this area from May the 1st to the 30th of September. £100 penalty. But yes, this seems a lovely hotel as well. And then we've got um, another pub, Sandown Cliffs, it looks like um, a with um, Premier Inn, also Cookhouse and Pub. More beach hops on the central beach for hire more car parking some people are sitting down on on the beach or sunbathing so that wraps up my video. There's the Premier Inn. A lovely, lovely beach hut. And I would like to say thank you for watching and I'll do another footage video at night um, for yourselves. And I would like to say thank you for 
watching and bye for now. Thank you. Bye.